It's so beautiful here. I love it. It's my favorite um, part. It's a favorite area and right now it's quiet. Usually in the evening it's El Poblado, like La Florida, and it's all crowded. You remember yesterday? Yeah. They have lots of bars, lots of restaurants, a lot of cl small clubs and hostels. And right now it's like 10 a.m. I was never I was never here on this time. Usually I'm in the gym or in bed or at home. Mm -hmm. Right now it's cool and we got the uh, recommendation that there's like a lot of good coffee places. Colombia is very well known for their coffee and since the language school just uh, rebuilds their own coffee place, they gave us the idea of Cafe Velvet and Cafe Berg Pergamino right yeah. next to each other. But it's actually Velvet. Huh? Bel Belbet. <laughs> You're right. Because Misha just taught me that bees are always, or bees are always bees. Yeah, here in Spain, uh, in uh, Colombia, I don't know. So that means like Venezuela is Venezuela. Uh huh. Crazy, huh? Yeah. yeah. Alright, so let's check this coffee out. Yes. I'm very excited. Nice. Never had a cold brew in a wine glass before. Wow. Wow. Very nice place, good location. And it's about one minute away from the gym we're gonna try today. So yesterday we played in Body Tech. I'm gonna show you this for sure another time. And this time we're gonna go to Ultra Wellness Center. I heard a lot of good stuff. I heard some bad stuff about it. So let's make our own opinion on it. Pretty excited because it's my first leg workout. Like a real workout since a week, yeah. I have my Dilo week, maybe you saw the video. <laughs> Watch it, kind of like it here. I just had the idea, this is like a kidney, yeah. kidney of, uh, of Medellin. This is like Earth Cafe, there are a lot of proud of people. Uh -huh. This is the other place that we heard is very good coffee. But yeah, this looks just like Abikini style, like these little... Outdoor places. This is like 10 times less expensive. <laughs> yeah. This hotel? Uh-huh. Charlie. The Charlie wow. Lifestyle Hotel. Is that where we're going to the gym? Yeah, there's the gym. It's into the building. Nice. All right, so we're here at Ultra Gym. It's a very nice gym. My view is crazy. You can yeah. see it. And uh, yeah, they have three three levels. I think downstairs is like a steam room so we could like go for a nice steam since our steam room is not working. <laughs> uh, upstairs is a crossfit area which is actually nice because in the other gym they just have one squat rack and this is the worst. Like one squat rack for all people. So upstairs they have like four, four stations. Oh like nice. Yeah, you can make a short run. Posing room, look. Do a nice picture here. Mm -hmm. Anabolic light. Probro everything. Probably everything. <laughs> yeah, so I would say let's let's start it. Let's get started. Yeah. On leg day. Uh -huh, uh -huh. <laughs> mm. This gym has like two stories, so yeah. <laughs> wow. Never gonna do this again. <laughs> Body tech all the way, baby. <laughs> so we're here at Lenteja Express. This it's our new favorite place. We're already um, regulars. It's, 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 it's the third day in a row, so it's a hat trick. But this is the first time we ordered this, and it looks pretty fatty. Empanadas. Baby, what did you do? I, I could just, have told you that it was going to be. Yeah, I was so proud today that I had like, my shape. Yeah, we took that still, awesome picture. Still on point. You took it, baby. Thank you. And now we're eating like something like this here. Yeah, but like, you know what it said? Like, 
Reino, which is usually in a chili. That's why I thought it was going to be different. But let's try. <coughs> okay. I think we're um, officially picking out today. Yeah. Is this true? Jesus Christ. We deserve it. Yeah. It's very good food here. Gonna... This looks like chicken. Oh, it's right. a mushroom? Yeah. Try the, the meat. Crunchy one, yeah. Yum, yum, yum. That's good. All vegan, baby. In Medellin. So, one of my favorite foods is Mediterranean. So we have hummus, falafel, and tabbouleh. And pita bread, which I know you're probably not gonna eat any of. <laughs> Just that. Those, those servings here are very big. Yeah. My um, quesadilla, I took it to go. Too yeah. much. Too much. I'm, I'm already full. All right, burrito on deck. And we paid 25 US dollars for Three plates of food, burrito, and I think we're out of here, baby. Yeah. By the way, a lot of people asked us why we're not uh, doing our daily vlogs. We should answer that after we're refreshed a little bit. Yeah, coming soon. Let's refresh. Yeah, it's actually very dangerous here. I think it's the, I think it's the only thing which is dangerous nighttime. So we just had a very nice uh, evening, had a good vine, and we're almost on the same place we've been this morning. But you see, like back there, a long street, a lot of people, a lot of uh, busyness. Here we have a very nice jungle. And I want to address a question we got under the last vlog of people asking us for daily vlogs. And I have to be real here. I have to be, be very like real. It's, it's not always as funny as fun. you think it is. It's fun. As fun as you think it is. You mean, you know, there's a lot of YouTubers like Casey Neistat used to do it, Joe Olsen, and they all like, I mean, their videos are great. I don't wanna like say anything against their videos. I love to watch videos like that, but for them it's a hassle. Yeah, it's a work. It's work, it's like real work. Like to do a video, to film an eating scene, to film like a nice scene, it can absorb you. Like taking the phone all the time and just checking your incident feed, you know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, and then there's the whole thing after the vlogging, like the editing and the music and yeah. it's like everything that you see is like it takes a lot of work and time. Exactly. But especially in the moment itself, it takes you something. And I'm a big, big, big believer in living in the moment. Like I read a lot of Eckhart Tolle, Power of Now, A New Earth. And that stuff, when you read this, you're gonna realize that a lot of people nowadays don't really live in their moments, and that's sad, especially because of social media. I mean, I love social media, I work on social media, I live on social media, but I always do it with consciousness. I always wanna share a part of my life, like being here in Medellin, having a good time, being in the gym, but sometimes we also need those moments for us, and you should do the same, so try try it for next year maybe to just reduce your social media consumption consumption even if that means you're not gonna watch every vlog all from us you know yeah. live in the moment people but after you take a break come back and watch the vlog yeah exactly <laughs> so people i hope you like the vlog 
first day or like first vlog here in Medellin. A lot of things are planned for the next few weeks. Road trips around the world, so be sure check that out. to check that out. <laughs> Stay tuned. Thanks for all the support. And, and see us next time. La prochaine fois. Gracias. Hasta mañana. Hasta luego, hasta mañana y au revoir. Peace out. Bye.